Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new, my name is Vivian and I do all kinds of videos. As you saw in my intro on beauty, tutorials, hauls, try-on videos, vlogs, all kinds of things. So if you're interested in any of those things, don't forget to hit the subscribe button below so you don't miss out on any of my future videos. But today, again, one of my most exciting videos that I do practically every month, or pretty much every month, is my Stitch Fix. Um, I have already unboxed it and tried everything on. I'll be putting everything on right here next to me, so don't forget to leave me a comment below. I love to read the comments, love to get you guys' input on the clothes, and then always at the end of each video, I will write in what I decided to keep and what I paid for each item. Okay, so I asked for you guys' feedback on my last couple videos if you wanted me to read the stylist note. Some of you said yes, <laughs> some of you said no, of course. So I'm just going to go ahead and read it this month, but I probably will go on and off with that, so just so you know. It says, hi Vivian, it's your first fix of 2018. I'm so excited to send you some amazing styles this year. I'm glad you enjoyed the coffee shop faux fur jacket from your last fix and hope you had the chance to wear it a few times. I have and I love it. I get so many compliments on it every time I wear it. You always give me great requests, so I'm happy to tell you I found some styles that will add some new life to your winter wardrobe. I love the layered blazer look. It's such a great balance between professional and edgy. Since you requested one, I'm sending the Central Park West convertible blazer. It has a detachable hood and lining. I'm also sending the Evolution by Cyrus plaid jacket. It's the longer style you like, and you'll be great. it'll be great from fall to spring. I can't wait to watch your video to see how these work out for you. XO Michelle. Hi, Michelle. Thank you so much. You are so awesome at coming through with all my requests or trying to at least and I really really appreciate it so let's get going okay so the first thing she sent me was a pair of black jeans these are the Pistola Aralyn distress scissor cut hem skinny jean <laughs> that's a mouthful these jeans are $88 and as soon as I put them on I was like done <laughs> in the front I have a little distressing right there and then the bottom hem is frayed and the other side again more distressing here towards the knee and then the bottom frayed and then in the back just very simple and then no distressing in the back so you guys I put these jeans on and they were so 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 comfortable I know I always say I have like other jeans I actually have <laughs> four pair of black jeans right here but I was looking through my jeans and you know kind of like evaluating whether or not I should keep these um, the price like I said was um, or they are $88 and I decided I think I'm gonna keep them but you'll also know at the end of the video for sure um, I really like the way they fit they were a little bit higher rise um, you'll see right here next to me I'll be trying them on um, I like the distressing and not overly distressed but good enough and then also I'm really into the unfinished hem and I didn't really have any of those that looked like this and then also these are stretchy I so all of those things put together I really didn't have one pair that included all of these things so I'm thinking I'm leaning towards keeping them but um, I don't know let me know what you guys think of how they look also I think they were a good length I can wear these with boots I can wear these with flats I can wear them with heels they're going to be pretty versatile and like I said, super stretchy and like super comfortable. So loving these so far. This is the Evolution by Cyrus Rosalind Collarless Knit Jacket and this is $98. And that is what it looks like. It's really nice. The only reason I think I might not keep it is because it's more of a sweater. Um, and I really wanted like a plaid winter coat, you know, like a more heavy duty one. And then also the sleeve seemed a bit too long on me. This is a size medium, but I don't think the small is going to be any better because I think then it's going to be a little too constricting, too tight. And then I'm not really going to be able to wear um, something underneath that's a little heavy. I wanted a plaid coat where I could like fully put on a sweater on underneath and I can't wear a sweater underneath a sweater if you kind of get what I mean I don't know let me leave me a note below let me know if you guys are kind of on the same page um, but it's really cool it's really pretty it's not itchy um, it's very soft um, I think it's super nice so it's kind of like a sweater coat um, and that's just not quite what I was looking for but I do love it and honestly if if the sleeves weren't so long because I don't want to have to like roll these up I don't like that look um, 
I might lean towards keeping it. You know, it's not a horrible price, but I think I'm going to save um, and just kind of put that money towards like what I really want, which is a like an actual winter plaid coat. Okay, then I got some jewelry. Came in this cute little box right here. There it is. It's just an already like stacked silver bracelet. Really, really nice quality, you know, kind of like heavy duty, but not so heavy that you'd be like, oh, I don't want to wear this on my wrist all night. Um, I really like it. It's really pretty. This is the Bancroft Pen Beaded Bracelet Set. Bracelet set, and this is $34, so not a bad price. Um, also, I'm going to leave everything detailed down below in the description box. If I can find these items, I will link them for you, especially if you're not part of Stitch Fix and you can't request it from your stylist. Maybe it's out there, maybe I can find it for you. If I can't find it, I'll try and link something similar. Um, and sometimes I can find stuff that's similar and cheaper. So don't forget to always check my description box. It's really pretty comfortable. I like it. I have other things that are kind of similar, so that's the only reason I wouldn't keep it. If I didn't have anything similar, I would say it'd be a for sure winner because it's really, really pretty. Okay, so the next thing I have is a sweater. Oh, I kind of going back and forth on this one too, you guys. It's super cute. Um, I really don't have anything like it. And this is what it is. It's kind of got like a rounded edge kind of goes up on the side right there um this is Leo and nicole zarin cotton blend poncho pullover and it is 68 dollars so price is not bad um but it's definitely it's more it's like a combination sweater poncho <laughs> because it does have you know an actual sleeve the only thing i don't like and you guys will see um with me here right next to me trying it on is this kind of is too attached right here. It just like pulls the whole thing up um, when I move my sleeve and my arm, and I don't like that. Um, otherwise, I probably would keep this. Um, so I'm kind of, again, on the fence. I love this like um, cowl neck, but very lightweight um, part here on the collar. I just, I think I really like it. I like the knitting. Um, I like the colors. It has a little bit of like gray, and like rose and white a little bit of black in it so i like the coloring and everything i think it'd look really cute with those black distressed jeans um but i'm just i'm not liking I'm, i really like to be comfortable and this part is just not comfortable for me so let me know what you guys think about that okay and last but not least probably my favorite thing in my stitch fix this month is this convertible blazer this is by Central Park West, the Veronica Convertible Blazer, $198. I can see why. It's really, really heavy duty, um, really nice, made very well. It's got some great detail here, like a, kind of like a plastic type zipper, but really cool detail um, on both sides. Here is the detachable, like, hoodie underneath it's kind of like a dicky um, and I think you could easily detach it um, here's the hoodie how it looks like right there I've seen these all over the place and I really was really intrigued by it I really like it a couple things number one the price probably more than I want to pay um, I was I mean if it'd be like 120 130 140 maybe um i'd say okay it's worth it i think it's a key piece i think i would have it for years and you could always take this off once this like trend is over and just use it as a blazer and it's it's a very nice blazer number two i kind of wanted it in black um this is navy i'm not a big navy girl and I would want to wear that and I'm not I don't like mixing navy and black so much I don't know if it's just a mental thing but I would want to wear these like with my like black over the knee boots or something like that and I I just think it would clash so those two things are really the only things that I'm like on the fence about it um, and it's holding me back but it's really nice it's a cool trend I think it's awesome I love it you could just wear it 
um, with like a little graphic tee underneath if you really want to dress it down, some jeans, some Converse, um, some sneakers. I think that would look really, really cute. And then you can dress it up. You can take the hoodie off. You could even wear this blazer to work. So, um, and it's even got some like really pretty buttons here on the sleeve. So overall, this is like a hit, like it's out of the park. Um, but I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. Okay, so that is everything I got in my Stitch Fix. I think it was a winner. I love it. I love that Michelle, as always, listens to my request and tries to get those for me. So the total, my subtotal was $486. The discount, 25% of $121.50. Um, it brings my total down to $364.50 if I were to keep everything. I know I'm not going to be able to keep everything. Um, obviously, I've got a trunk club coming up, so I won't be keeping everything, but... Um, I'll let you know at the end of the video what I decided to keep. So if you guys like these kind of videos, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up, leave me a comment below, and of course, don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on my future videos. Thanks guys. Bye.